Congratulations! Has Chicago State University confirms Tinubu attended school and graduated with bachelor's degree in 1979. <laughs> this is getting more complicated. Welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you for always coming out here. If you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe and don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you. The Chicago State University has confirmed that President Bola Tinubu attended the school. It said Tinubu attended the Chicago State University and graduated in 1979 with bachelor's degree. The university disclosed this in a statement issued to CBS News, a division of the American television and radio service CBS, on Thursday. It, however, added that it is prevented by the federal law from providing any further information without consent or, or less allowed to do so via court order. Atiku Abubakar, the candidate of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, in the 2023 presidential election, had alleged that Tinubu's academic records showing he graduated from Chicago State University we are not authentic, arguing that it is, it is grounds to nullify Tinubu's election victory in the election. Tinubu submitted diploma certificates to the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, and Atiku is pushing for Tinubu's election to be nullified over allegations that they submitted he submitted fake records to the electoral body. The United States District Court for the Northern District of Illinois earlier this week a joint ruling on a subpoena application for Tinubu's records from the university. The adjournment came on Thursday after the Chicago State University said it was not in a position to confirm the certificate Tinubu submitted to Nigeria's electoral body to run for office. According to the report, before Judge Jeffrey Glibert in Chicago, they see the Chicago State University lawyer, Michael Hayes, categorically stated that the school was not in a position to authenticate Tinubu's certificate submitted to INEC as either fake or genuine. Is the diploma authentic or is it a, a forgery? The question was raised in the court. My client cannot answer yes to either of these questions. Hayes said at the hearing in Chicago that began at about 1.30 p.m. and lasted several hours in the lawsuit brought by Atiku Abubakar, Tinubu's main challenger during the February 25th, 2023 election. Hayes was responding to the judge's inquiry into the school's ability to confirm under oath that Tinubu was issued the certificate he tendered to Nigerian's electoral office as part of his final eligibility paperwork in June 2022. However, in a statement, the school confirmed that Tinubu attended the Chicago State University and graduated in 1979. It also referred to him as a former student. It said, as an educational institution, we are sometimes asked to provide information related to students' records. The federal law, known as FERPA, F-E-R-O-P-A, that is the Family Educational Rights and the Privacy Act, protect the privacy of students' records and limit what an institution can release. In August 2023, a request was made in the U.S. federal court for the university to provide information related to educational background concerning Bola Tinubu, the president of Nigeria and the former, and the former Chicago State University student. The university has confirmed Tinubu's attended the Chicago State University and graduated in 1979 with a bachelor's degree. The federal law, however, prevents us from providing the further information without consent or, or, or less follow to do 
so via court's order. Chicago State University is confident in the veracity and integrity of our records regarding Tinubu's completion of graduation requirements and degree certificates, and the, the university is not a party to the Nigerian legal proceedings that spread this request, and the U.S. federal judge will determine whether the university will provide their further requested information. Our response to the request for Tinubu's academic records has been entirely consent with our practice, policies, and the federal law. We should be responded in exactly the same manner for each request for any student's information by a third party. So guys, have you heard it now? Story don't change you. And someone said, congratulations, sir. Congratulations, Mr. President. This is what they call America Wonder. Stories for the gods. Hmm. When with this hate going to rest, what evidence do you need that their believed lost? He cannot rule this Nigeria. That he can never rule this Nigeria. May the Supreme Court attendance rest. If Buhari, who had no bachelor's degree, could lead the Nigeria, how much more Buhari? The basic requirement for that person is SS, SSCE. Let's grow. Let's grow up. Okay, guys, these are some reactions from Nigerians. So, what's your take on this new development? Please let's hear from you. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Thank you.